quick five tips of what you really need to focus on as a coach, consultant, digital provider for your 2021. Let's get into the video. Hello, hello, Just Start Gang. It's Shanique here from Start With Neeks, the home of the Just Start University and Instapreneur Mastery Accelerator Membership Group, helping you Christian coaches, consultants, and digital providers to kill it on Instagram, attract your dream client so you can make consistent four-figure months doing what you love. So be sure to subscribe to my channel and you can follow me on Instagram for more tip, advices, and lifestyle with me, Shanique, your coach. All right, so I'm gonna make this video very concise and clear my five top areas to focus on to increase your sales, increase your following on Instagram, and increase your overall business. What you should focus on in 2021, let's get right into the list. No specific orders, you just wanna focus on all of them, to be honest with you, if you want a better, more successful 2021 new year. The first thing you want to focus on is your brand story and to clarify who you are. Who do you want to be known for? You really want to make sure that you have a clear brand that your audience can really set you apart from your competitors and it's going to really help you to be remembered, to be noticed, to be visible, to have returning followers, to have returning clients, to have people refer you and much more clearly when you have a story, what do you want to be known for? Even your visibility, what sets you apart from your competitors, especially on Instagram where there's so much new resources, new features, people are coming and flooding that platform with so much content. Be sure to watch this video if you want to know how those new updates really help you but you want to set yourself apart visually how is your content what are your brand colors what's your brand font how are you setting yourself apart get on that brand story be really clear about who you are what makes you different what makes you authentic the second thing that you want to be clear on in 2021 is to be very clear about your offer. What you don't want to do is to be continuously tailoring and, and removing and adding in pieces to your offer. Be very clear, uh, be true to what your service offers and what it doesn't offer. Because if you're going to pull in, all of a sudden you're going to offer website design and that's not what you do, you're not going to give your best because that's not what your service is all about. You're not gonna make your client happy. You're not gonna get great reviews. So you need to be very clear, be really firm in what you offer and what you don't offer. And if somebody comes in and they're just not a right fit for your service, that's okay. You wanna make room for people that best maximize for, for your service. They offer great testimonials, great referrals. You want people to come in your business to be really happy with your service. And if you keep alterating and changing it up all the time, just to get a, a few dollars, you're not gonna do anything for your business. You're not gonna benefit from that. You're gonna be tired, you're gonna be overwhelmed, you're gonna be um, confused because you're back and forth between what you actually do. So what you wanna do in 2021 is be super clear about what you offer. Be clear about your offer. And if that is something that you struggle with or you really want to be able to hone in for 2021, be sure to join the Just Start University waitlist for new coaches, consultants, and digital providers. But once you have a clear offer, you want to continue to push and promote your service. And once you are doing that, the third thing you want to focus on and get really clear with is your conversion rates. Know how many people are clicking on your lead magnets or your website. Know how many people are opting into your emails. Know how many people are opening up your, your emailing list. Know how many people are buying to how many people are not buying. Um, know what uh, emails do work. Know what posts works. You want to really know your conversion rates. And by doing that, you also want to know your analytics. And most platforms offer those things. Instagram is growing with their analytics. Um, being able to share with you what posts are doing great and what are not, how your engagement is, how your interaction with, because you want to work with that. How many people are visiting your page versus how many people are opting to emailing this. So in 2021, get on those conversion rates, get an understanding, get a grip on your analytics. You want to know those numbers because once you understand those numbers, you're able to maneuver and create a marketing strategy that will help your business. All right, so that brings us into the fourth really huge focus for 2021 it's your emailing list okay so we just talked about convert kit and that's an amazing platform that you need to check out you want to build an emailing list okay an emailing list is that pool of warm 
audience because they probably opt into something which is usually a freebie and they're warm they are interested in what you offered and now you can nurture them in your emailing list and your email list is probably more powerful than your followers and that is why i always say you can make your first a thousand dollars under a thousand followers okay so check out these videos if you also want more tips on how to do that and how to maximize your instagram with under a thousand followers that is the most effective and most life-saving portion of your business trust me and when you launch products you want to be able to have a really chunky email list to be able to share and promote your promotions to share and promote your services so in 2021 get on maximizing your emailing list now so the last focus that i'm going to talk about is your content audience connection so what you want to do is to use your analytics and see what's working and see what's not working but you really want to be able to engage with your audience effectively okay so engaging is not um, solely just double tapping and liking on everyone's post or just leaving aimless comments there is a genuine heart to connecting with your audience and there's many ways so you can connect via your content when it comes to your captions and speaking to the desires speaking to the pain points of your audience and that's why you would want to know your audience really well because that really helps with the connection part um, you can connect with messaging, DMing, um, encouraging, genuinely caring for your audience. A lot of the boost in my conversion had to do with my engagement with my audience. Me taking the time to DM a few people to just see how they're doing. Um, you know, congratulate them on a, a win or a success or just ask them what they're struggling with because that connection allows somebody that thinks that no one is seeing them and um, lets them know that they're being heard and you are that person and it gives a great opening for you to discuss ways that you can solve their problem and that way may be with your service or products so what you want to do is be sure that your content your emails your verbiage your videos has a great connection with your audience make that a skill in 2021 because without connection people are not going to get to know you without connection people don't believe that you are someone that could be trusted and without that connection there's no sales and no followers so in 2021 be sure to grow your ability to connect with your audience and by watching this video you're going to learn three awesome ways to do that and be able to connect with your audience via your content so check out that video as well let me know below which one of the five focuses that you've been neglecting in 2020 that you will for sure commit in 2021 that you're going to implement in your business so that you can see more sales, more followers, more impact, and more influence from your business to the world initially. So let me know in the comments. I love to hear about it. And maybe I can make content to help you boost that up as well. So be sure to keep sharing the good news and keep up the great work. I'll see you in my next video.